How are you? What's your name? Yoku. Yoku. This is the Royal King. My name is the Royal King. And uh, we are giving the opportunity to our classmates, that is, a 1994 year group Aguna Sori School. Okay, that's fine. Who owns small or bigger businesses? Yeah. We want to sell them first because as we feel here. Hello, lovely viewers. This is your man Ajambi. You can always call me the Royal, the Royal King. This is your man, the Royal King himself. The Royal King. TV. We're trying to give opportunity to. Every Sesconian who owns a small business, especially 1994 year group, and we are at the Noble Captain's Academy. Um, before we start everything, let's go inside and meet the principal of the school. Captains International or Nobu Captains Academy. Um, we've gone to the principal's office and the administrator. We are now going to one of the classrooms. So come on, let's go. Hello. Yes, I want to Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Um, we are fine. Thank you. Oh, I'm also fine. We are fine. We are a team, right? And um, my name is Bernard Jambra. She's my classmates in 1994 at uh, Aguna City School. And my team, we are, oh, sit down, please. This is um, the Royal King TV. We are YouTubers. And um, there is a saying that when you get opportunity, you have to help others, right? So this is what we're doing. Um, I would say a journalist or a, a, a vlogger trying to sell the small businesses of my classmates. This is what I can do, or this is what I can offer my classmates. Just a little bit I can offer. If I don't have money, I will use my influence to sell their businesses. And uh, that is why we are here, to inspect the school and to tell the rest of the world that there is a better school somewhere called what? What is the name of the school? I did not hear you. Noble Captains Academy. This they are the indeed Royal King TV. My name Noble. is Royal King. Thank you so much. We are giving the opportunity to our classmates, that is a 1994 year group, Aguna Sori School. Okay, that's fine. Who owns small or bigger businesses. Yeah. We want to sell them first because as you will feel yeah. You know. So um that is why I talked to my sister and said, okay, my husband and I we own some business. That is a school, so would you like to come around? Say, yes, of course. I can see this is even a well-established school. How many students do you have? Currently, we are almost getting to 100. We started only in January. Oh, just this just year, January? Yes. Oh, OK. And how is the performance of the students so far? So far, we, we can say that we have bridged the gap. Mm -hmm. We know this is a village, mm -hmm. and most of the Students around live around this area. Mm -hmm. Some came from Accra, mm -hmm. but majority we are having we are schooling around this area. This is an international school, but we are trying to run a hybrid curriculum. I mean, the Ghana education mm -hmm. curriculum and some aspects of the international curriculum, so we can have a well-educated student from this place or a globally educated, internationally educated student from this place. Okay, thank you very much. Do you usually transport them or you, uh, you have a boarding, boarding system? It is a day school for now. We, have, um, we, are, we are now building our boarding facility, mm -hmm. but for now it's a day school, so we run the transport system. So we have buses that pick the students from home to school, 
and not so from school to home after school. So looking at the location of the school, how secure you think in terms of like the student security, how you think, um, how secure the students are? It's obvious, you, you can see that mm -hmm. we have a build walls around, mm -hmm. we have our security men in place, mm -hmm. and thankfully to the police, Ghana police, mm -hmm. they patrol this place almost all the time. And kudos to the commander of this area. Mm -hmm. He has been here several occasions, he has assured us of his men coming out around almost every three hours to come and pass by mm -hmm. through to the night until daybreak. So yeah. the, the place is very secure. Okay. Since we came okay. running for the, the preschool, right okay. from Kretch, nursery, KG, mm -hmm. lower primary, okay. and um, upper yes. primary mm -hmm. for now. Mm -hmm. We intend to go into JHS next mm -hmm. year. You mm -hmm. know, our facilities are ready. Mm -hmm. We have world class facilities, I mean, world class facilities where students are given technology. Mm -hmm. I miss their textbooks to learn mm -hmm. and to improve upon their lot. Mm -hmm. We are a child-based mm -hmm. learning school mm -hmm. where the children are given opportunity to discover mm -hmm. what they want to learn by themselves. So this is, that's why I said we are running the hybrid, the international hybrid, yeah. program and that of the Ghana Education Service. We have our um, space of the arts facilities. So you can wow. see our um, lab, computer lab, you can see our classrooms. You can go around and see yeah. state of the arts facilities. You can see our sporting uh, area also. Mm -hmm. State of the arts sporting facilities. And this is what we are offering the people of Bumuafete, Kakraba, and the people living in and around this area. We are telling them they should come and will never regret coming to Noble Captain's Academy. This is where their future begins. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, you've, you've, made, you've made my job very easy because I wanted to ask you all these questions yes. after going around yes, and yes. you've just summarized it yes, for me. Yes, yes, all yes. right, so we'll be going to the classroom to see so the... So, Mr. King, mm -hmm. you can bring your children as well? Sure. <laughs> sure. Come we'll, from Sweden, we will always transport them, no problem. No pro oh, okay, yeah. no problem. Thank you. Uh, we'll go to the classroom and see... The, uh, they have a um, uh, computer laboratory, right? Yes. Yeah, we would like to see the laboratory yes. and some you of the go run, Go yeah. run, see oh, the right. school, see the classrooms, okay. and see our state of the arts uh, technology that we have. Thank you. Thank you very much. The principal of the school. This is a new school and it was started just this year, January. So you can see um, they have about 100 students 
and it's increasing. Admission is still in progress, yes. Admission is still in progress, so be fast and come to Fete Kakraba and look for Noble Captains Academy. Look at their, their, uh, their field, the basketball field, and, and they are also building a boarding, boarding facility. They have a playground over there, you can see, for the kids, and they have buses to transport the student from wherever you are to school and vice versa. So don't hesitate to bring your ward to Noble Captains Academy. It's already well established school. Look at the way the facility is. It's, it's state of the art. It's a modern kind of school. I would recommend for every parent to bring your ward to the school. They have just 100 students and it's increasing. They are still doing the, uh, the admission. So don't hesitate to bring your ward to the school. We are still on uh, the Royal King's tour for Swesconians, especially 1994 year group who owns small businesses or bigger businesses. So just call us, let's come to your place. Let's talk to you about your business so that um, you'll be able to sell your business. Currently we are at their computer lab and you can see <laughs> the captains mean it. The captain mean it. You mean you mean business. Trust me. They have one, two, three, four, five, ten, fifteen, twenty computers for students. It's not easy and it's it's being run by each class. And trust me, this is a HP computer it is wow. Is that a Mamboka my adze? <laughs> so this is the book of this academy. I, I don't know. This I'm man so is in charge of the lab. Please, what's your name? Please, I'm Sir Albert. Sir Albert Arthur. Oh, Sir S I R Sir Albert Arthur. Okay. All right. So um, I've already counted the computer though. So I guess you have twenty computers, right? Yes. Yeah. So what what are some of the programs you you, you teach these kids? We teach them Excel, Microsoft Word, mm -hmm. PowerPoint. We have other uh, applications, mm -hmm. typing, maybe Vicom, and mm -hmm. other uh, software that they use for learning, mm -hmm. uh, dictionaries, and programming, other programming to our own for them. We basically, they learn the basics in Excel. Yeah, I was about to ask. And fine for average and other stuff. A lot. Mm -hmm. We have a lot of things that they learn here. Mm -hmm. There are some basic things that others may not know, mm -hmm. but at their level, even in primary, they are able to do all those things. Okay. It doesn't, don't, you don't have to look at their age or their level. Mm -hmm. There are some big things that they do here. Mm -hmm. A lot. A lot. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, Sir Arthur, right? Yes, please. Yes. Um, for your hard work, and I suppose you will do your quota, you are not only working for money. You are working for Mother Ghana sure. and for the future of these kids. Sure. You'd be surprised one of these kids will grow up to give you a recommendation. Um, we appreciate your help. We appreciate your effort. We appreciate every input that you are putting in to bring these children to a level that Mother Ghana and the world will need. You'll be proud to see one of your, your students working at the UN uh, or WHO or you know any higher position, you be proud to say it's a hey, this is my student. Yes. Thank you so much, Mr. Arthur. Thank you. My name is the Royal King. The Royal King. So you can check Royal out, King. subscribe to the Royal King TV. Go to YouTube right now, subscribe to the Royal I'll King TV. All right. I'll okay, so that you can follow us on everything that we do. All right. Thank you very much. <laughs>